Brian Venikalik, the co-founder and co-director of the Institute for Habits of Mind. And this is such an exciting project because it so fulfills all of the obligations and commitments that we have as an Institute for Habits of Mind with our certified schools. And Escola Concept is agreed as a certified school and it means each of the three schools are certified with the Habits of Mind. And what we do is we look at one of the key ingredients for that certification is that you remain open to continuous learning. And for that reason, this is a perfect project of looking at how do you do action research as a way of remaining open to continuous learning? Damien, you wanna explain that? Thank you, Benna. So I'm Damien Bebel, uh, a research professor at Boston College. And for the last seven months, I've been working with Benna and Allison and Priscilla and the leadership and teachers at Escola Concept across their three campuses on a program we call Supporting Teachers as Researchers or the STAR program. And what we've done is we've built upon the culture and infrastructure leadership and support like Ben and Allison have provided and really facilitated allowing teachers to develop a research question and then a research methodology and plan to actually collect some data over the tumultuous seven months of 2020. And what you'll be seeing today is some presentations of their projects and results and learnings they've gleaned. Allison? Thanks so much, Damien. I'm Allison Zamuda, and it's just such a, a rich moment right now to have an opportunity to reflect on the range of action research projects that are outlined in front of you. And the interesting dynamic, especially due to the realities of the pandemic, there's been such a, a, a rich and creative space for teachers to engage in problems of practice, areas of focus that are very much connected to habits of mind, but also the power and the beauty of what the STAR um, uh, projects have gleaned is that they start with creating, imagining, and innovating as the bedrock for how teachers can view assessment and data in a very different way. So the other interesting point of this is that teachers are also doing this in consultation with students and families. So from a personalizing point of view, not only did teachers have the opportunity to design and create something that is connected to them, they find valuable, but they're also continuing to engage with their students and families um, and being very upfront with this as an action research project so they can be partners in the work. Benna? Well, it's really such an exciting time because now we are here to celebrate that work and to realize that it all happened. It happened because we were so committed to it. And so now we invite you to really make a serious commitment to looking at it. Not necessarily that you have to read everything in depth, but we would like you to actually take the time to be a good thinker and to really look at what you observe and give some commentary that is really showing the people who have done this work what you are thinking. And a way to share that will be we're gonna ask you to use one of our thinking routines that we use regularly in the school. So we're gonna to say to you, when you go in and you start looking at a particular project, first do a C, which means don't judge it. Don't start thinking about all the ways people could have done it differently or better or whatever goes on in your mind. Just see what they're doing. And then once you see what they're doing, think about what really jumps out at you? What was significant about this? What made you really think about this and really wonder about it? And so in your comment, write that down. Just a phrase or two, maybe just a bullet point. Just something that says, wow, when I looked at this, here's what I saw in it that really struck a chord for me. And then as you walk away, you may wonder, what else could we do about this? What other questions do we have in our mind? So if you will, please take the time to visit the celebrated beautiful research projects and do your seeing, your thinking, and we hope we leave you with lots to wonder about. Mm -hmm.